Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and today I am starting a new series of tutorial and this tutorial will be on creating uh, react native apps as well as uh, the some gadgets using uh, microcontrollers like Arduino or some other microcontroller that is available that will meet our need so for this uh, I think Arduino will be sufficient so this app will be a smart switch app so you must have heard that uh, IoT is in great demand these days and uh, uh, so we will be also uh, uh, coding IoT devices as well as we will make our app work with IoT devices so that is the exact idea uh, to start this tutorial so uh, let's see uh, what we have in this tutorial so we will be creating a smart switch app the smart switch app will have uh, many switches for different purpose and uh, you can create any number of switches uh, what according to your need so suppose you want to uh, turn off a light automatically after two minutes then you can create a switch for that or say if you want to turn the same light for uh, after five minutes or ten minutes uh, then you can create a separate switch for that so you can use either of the switch according to your need so this will be exactly how our uh, device and app will work and the device will connect with the switch using bluetooth so first we have to create an app that has the bluetooth feature so we will we are starting with that and uh, here is the code so this code what basically it, it's doing is that uh, uh, when the code uh, the app loads then it detects all the bluetooth devices that are active around and it lists it uh, i mean the paired devices uh, that has already been paired uh, that uh, that will be listed and uh, if the bluetooth is uh, disabled then uh, nothing will be listed but there there is a switch to enable or disable the bluetooth in the app itself so if uh, we want if we enable the bluetooth from the app then 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 also all the de uh, paired devices will be listed and uh, user can uh, connect to the paired device and the pairing part we we are we are not doing in this part and uh, also the data transfer we are not doing in this part so basically uh, for this first part we we are just uh, listing the uh, paired devices and if we are uh, enabling and disabling the uh, the bluetooth so this is the code that is here you can see uh, here we are when the uh, app loads then we are just checking the status of bluetooth and we are if it is enabled then we are uh, fetching the list of paired devices and we are this uh, rendering it on the screen and we also have a here we have a switch for toggling the bluetooth status so if it is on it will be turned off if it is off it is it will be turned on and if you see uh, when the switch is toggled then the bluetooth is enabled or disabled and if it is enabled then again uh, it fetches the list of paired devices and uh, it renders on the screen so that's what uh, we are doing in this and in the next tutorial th that is the next part of this tutorial we will be uh, uh, connecting to uh, other device and we will be doing the data transfer part and uh, again after that we have to create a device using the Arduino board so for this project we will be using Arduino board microcontroller and uh, uh, we will be uh, creating the uh, a light or something like that so that we can control it with a smart switch so uh, there's lot to do in this tutorial this is just the first part 
and if you like this part then please uh, do subscribe to our channel if you have any doubts then please leave a comment uh, i think that your likes are uh, very much encouraging and it makes uh, us uh, to create uh, better tutorials for you so let's also have a look of the demo how this uh, the first part is working whatever code we have done so this is the device so you can see at present there is no uh, device list but if we turn on the bluetooth so bluetooth has turned on and uh, all the pair devices with this mobile has been listed if we turn off then the devices go away again if we turn on see you can see there that bluetooth is getting turned on and all the devices around is getting listed so uh, the code is working uh, quite good till here and let's see how things goes uh, after that and thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial and just if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe to the channel and stay tuned and uh, have a nice day